Hey Leo, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you all are well. Today's reading will be more intuitive. Let's just see what important messages from divine are coming through. This will not resonate for each and every one of you. If the message feels right, keep it. If it doesn't, then surrender it back to universe, okay? These cards have already been pre-shuffled. I also want to thank each and every one of you for being here and supporting the channel. With that said, let's begin. What's going on for the sign of Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? By the way, happy, happy birthday, Leo. I hope you guys are having an amazing season. I hope that this reading resonates for you. So what's going on for the sign of Leo, please? All right, so first card, we have the Two of Cups. Wow. There's new inspiration here for you. We have the Hangman. The Ace of Wands. And the Empress. Some of you are dealing with a Libra. Can also be a Taurus energy. So this season, it's definitely about creativity, growth, and expansion for you, Leo. In all levels, okay? The Empress is you recognizing that you have what it takes to be very successful and abundant. So when accepting any kind of offer or proposal... There's really a need for you to contemplate and really meditate, okay? What is this person going to bring towards my life? Is this person going to reciprocate? Because once I do accept this offer, I will go over and beyond. That's the Empress. Very generous, very giving, motherly-like, okay? Kind of treatment to the ones that you love. Unconditional love as well. So before you reach that level, I see here a decision making, the hangman, right? The need to take a pause, you know, observe, contemplate, not be too quick on making impulsive decision. We have the ace of wands. Yes, you recognize potential. You recognize the seed, even the intense attraction that you feel for this new person. But the guidance here is to not rush in, Leo. You're highly encouraged to get to know somebody. It's not about delaying things, but it's about making uh, sure that you're not rushing in. You're thinking of the consequences along the way. You're building this in a proper foundation. So the Ace of Wands, this is the energy to uh, finally take action, right? It's, a, it's an awakening. I see that the Ace of Wands and the Empress, you are the one that has been awakened. You are in your season. There is a reemergence of a different passion in you. Um, almost sending a very strong message out there to the world that here I am. I'm celebrating myself. I'm embodying my own sensuality. I'm a very creative person. I'm very self-sufficient. So that's pretty good. And I do feel like you're rushing in taking any kind of solid offer. Although I see that you're being inspired by somebody new. This two of cups can also represent friendship. It doesn't have to be just a romantic interest. Some of you, something definitely weighed you down in the recent past. But you're rediscovering here a different strength in you because of what you have experienced. You could be in the process of releasing that now with the hangman. Okay, let's see. What else can we get for Leo? We have the Page of Pentacles, the King of Cups, the Five of Swords, and the Nine of Wands. Okay, so I see that there is definitely a choice that you need to make, Leo. For some of you, it's a choice between somebody new and somebody from your past. And the reason why I said somebody from the past, because I see two court cards here, King of Cups and Page of Pentacles, both of them are trying to fight for your love, okay? With Five of Swords, there's power play conflict going on here. It can also be a sense of competition, but it's starting to become quite toxic for the people involved. I do feel like this has been causing you stress and burden. Um, this talks about the wounded soldier with the Nine of Wands. I see that you're really starting to keep your distance and doing what is necessary to protect your space and your inner peace, okay? However, if left unresolved here, Leo, things can get pretty chaotic and uh, can be blown out of proportion because I feel like somebody has tendency for childish behavior. We have the Five of Swords. 
So you might also be dealing with a younger person. We have Page of Pentacles. They have an offer, a proposal. But like you said, you're you're really taking your time to really think, process everything. Being the Empress, they need to sort of step up here, Leo, to match your frequency and your energy. Because like I said, when you say yes and when you get into a commitment, you really do your part and, you know, do more of what is expected, okay? So you learn from your past and you're not going to be as sacrificing or be inclined and quick to take an offer. You're being smarter about your choices here. You already know and have a good idea of who your perfect match should be. But with King of Cups and Page of Pentacles, I see here ego clashing. People want to appear superior. People want to compete for your love, for your attention. So with King of Cups, I see that in the past, you may have dealt with somebody that has secretive or mysterious ways. They have a tendency to detach from you, keep things from you. Might have also been some form of manipulation. Just beside this is the Five of Swords, King of Cups and Five of Swords here. All right. Um, and by manipulation, I mean, it's like they were willing to do different tactics to get the upper hand or prove a point. But Leo, this is not something that's sitting right with your gut. Being the Empress, you're all about in the energy of love. Re See, the first card is the Two of Cups. You want a real emotional connection. And love cannot exist in an aura of drama, negativity okay or somebody wanting to gloat their success that's not going to exist in the energy of love so you want to keep building that walls or not really walls but distance yourself and watch out okay this is a card of needing to observe watch out and be very cautious okay and the page of pentacles here i do feel like you are now paying close attention to the smallest of details extremely paying attention it could be even a specific person that you're observing at the moment okay two of cups and the page of pentacles because you don't like this kind of behavior the childish behavior okay some of you feel tired because you may have tried to meet this person halfway understand their tendencies understand their childish side okay but i feel like the more you try to level with this person the more it also burdened you with Knight of Wands. It is, it's as if it weighed you down, okay? So with the Empress, as you stand strong in your power, you realize I'm no longer going to overcompromise myself. And the guidance here is that when this person is ready, when this person realizes that I'm looking for something more long-term or more mature, I want somebody to see love and not try to behave this way. That's the only time that you're also going to take a chance on the offer being presented, okay? Um, I also feel like this could be a new work partnership for some of you. And the Five of Swords is somebody trying to compete, but you are the creative force here, Ace of Wands and the Empress. Okay, this season, you will really be expanding your ideas after a period of pause and reflection. You may have felt like somebody who was on your corner here, Leo, was trying to sabotage the success that you have. So whatever mind games they're trying to plot here is going to come around biting this person back, okay? Because you're not giving up. If their intention was to throw you off your balance, I feel like you're going to be re-emerging as the victor here. Yes, you may have been wounded, but you have the victory especially with the empress it's a rebirth process it's a it's a yes card it's pretty much saying that all your efforts here have clearly yield results right that's the number three results outcome so all the hard work is not been in vain leo patiently wait with the hangman trust in divine timing and choose your battles this is not worth it with the five of swords this is not an honorable victory some people may choose to play it dirty like this, but that's not you, okay? So let's get some advice card here. It's pretty interesting energy. What is your advice for Leo, please, going through this situation, okay? This card over here. We have discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to. And pretty interesting with the hangman, because I see here it is 
some kind of halo the mind is very disciplined right um discipline in a way that you're not going to be straying away from your goals you're not going to be intimidated or distracted by all this chaotic energy going on in the environment some of you discipline is also holding your ground and knowing what's best for you right getting rid of the unnecessary getting rid of the unhealthy energies situations okay and discipline is also knowing what's going to be right in the long uh, long run not just because of the impulsiveness of it all okay it's also saying that i will wait for the right offer right person i will not be impulsively saying yes to anything that's not aligning with my current goals and beliefs so this is what i see for you leo thank you so much for watching till the end i'm sending you love and light and namaste